Hi everyone, this is a video about this GTEC cordless power sweeper. There are some videos about this uh, in the market and on YouTube you can watch those but this video mainly is about is it any good or not. I have uh, used uh, these for a long time and I wanted to show you that uh, these uh, sweepers they are prone to some problems these are all the bits that they are coming with it but this unit has some extras that I show you later and sorry that I have to put this on this in the um, sideways because it doesn't fit here so uh, this is a Packaging, sorry that is a little bit battered, but it's not about the box, it's about the unit itself, how the quality deteriorated through throughout time, <clears throat> and is it any good or not uh, without actually testing it. Anyhow, let's uh, get it out of the box and we talk more. So this unit is brand new and it looks like this as you turn it on. Sorry about the noise. It's really loud. It has a brush here and a side brush here. At, uh, soon after a little while, this one is getting really loose. I show you in the older model and it has a dirt container that it comes out like this and there are loads of places if you want to wash it is really making it difficult to wash so this is it and then is rechargeable you have uh, a uh, socket for the charging and the charger looks like this is the 12 volt 150 milliamp charger for a battery of like this that is 4.7.4 uh, uh, volt that uh, is really enough for this but the later model came with nine more battery with two 18650 batteries uh, that is much better I'm gonna show you I have to keep this video short the first thing I wanted to show you is about the handle the handle used to be the handle of this it used to be like this a piece of metal and later they decided to make it plastic as you see is a plastic there this is the unit with all of this attached so and now uh, the new ones is prone to break from those four uh, latches that latches to this part so the quality deteriorated throughout time and this is for this unit this unit is one of the older ones that it just something comes out here and then you push this there and then push this back in and the uh, handle is secure. So what are the uh, faults that you have to expect from this? First thing, as I mentioned, this side brush uh, uh, brush is getting loose soon after a while and then as you knock it uh, to the wall and so on it might come off and then the these wheels they are this is brand new these wheels they are loose and as you knock it there and here is going to come off and then after a while you cannot even put them back on anyhow 
this is the brand new one we just push it put it there and i show you the used one this is the used one and as you see the wheels they came off and you you can push it back on and then this side brush head as you see is turning without any uh, friction but the brand new one you cannot turn it at all because it is brand new and all the gears are firmly in place so and uh, this is the handle that I told you that they are uh, putting on and you can use it like so for just brushing with your hand and I put this one back and we go to the brand new one because it's cleaner and my used one is washed and cleaned properly this one comes with handles like this and these handles they are prone to get loose at the joints and they are going to move about a lot and then it has an upper handle that it clicks like so and after a while this one if you can see there there is a notch here that the notch is going to erode and uh, because of the friction is going to rub off and is going to break from here and there and there so you have to be really gentle with this handle and this one as i mentioned it comes with this uh, 12 volt 150 milliamp batteries uh, charger and this model it comes with a, with a dusting brush and the dusting brush has a handle that it fits in there and then another attachment that you can attach it to this main uh, post that is going up the handle so so the later ones comes with Nymo batteries. I have another model here that it comes with a Nymo battery. This is the one. Uh, this is used but washed thoroughly for the purpose of this video and some of them they don't have this side brush. This side brush is more of a gimmick because after a while it is coming off and if you look at the battery here it is totally different than the battery that we saw in the other model earlier model and here it says uh, Leo ion batteries and the charger must be 10 volts uh, 1000 milliamp and as you see after a while they are becoming loose and but it does the job more or less and again this one you can do it uh, brush like this and this one is used but uh, is in great condition and it also suffers from these wheels as well so some of them, um, I have to say, some of them, they charge with the charger that you just stand it like so on it. Also, you can charge it uh, from the cable. That is a good option, but I don't like the electricity minus and plus. It would be exposed like that in case of water is getting in there. Anyhow, at the end of this video, I just wanted to say that personally, I do not recommend this item. 
unless you are very careful with this otherwise is getting these wheels are getting loose and yeah this side brush you can knock it off and totally is meh. good good item but is not as good as other items that are in the market anyhow this video is supposed to be a short video about this gtec sweeper and this model is sw02 and the other one this one is much more expensive this one the brand new one it comes minimum of 69 under 70 pounds and this one uh, swg22 comes at 110 upwards because the battery is leo iron and it has a standing charger and uh, totally some of them they have this side brush head as well i would rather not to have one because after a while is uh, you can knock it off anyhow in total they are good items but uh, it needs lots of maintenance the um, brushes they are gathering hair especially long hairs and they are getting dirty and uh, if you want to wash it it's, it's a little bit of pain really and that's really it i if i want to give you my recommendations i would rather you to buy something that is less prone to uh, become damaged and um, it requires lesser maintenance anyhow i hope you enjoyed this video until my next video thanks for watching and take care of yourself and each other and as always have a great time